Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 20. It is officially five days until Christmas and that is so, so exciting. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how I did this classic Christmas glam. Without further ado, let's get on into the video. So the first thing I'm going to do is put on some chapstick because my lips are really dry. This is just the chapstick brand and this is vanilla latte, I think. It seriously is so good. Now I'm going to be using the e.l.f. Poreless Putty Primer. I'm in the shade Sheer. And I'm just going to rub my fingers in it and then put it all over my face. Now that my face is primed and ready, I'm going to be using the Fenty Beauty Matte Foundation. And I am in the shade 280. Before I put this on though, it does not match my skin perfectly right now. Because as you can tell, I'm very pale right now. And I usually am tanning and I haven't been in a while so this doesn't match perfectly but it works so I forgot to say this is just a Real Techniques beauty sponge it's like the the tie-dye one I thought it was super pretty but I just got it wet put some foundation on it and I'm just gonna dab it all over my face now I am going to be taking the Tarte Shape Tape I'm in the shade 27B light to medium beige I'm going to put some under my eyes, down my nose, my chin, and my forehead. And then I'm going to blend it with the same sponge. Now I'm going to be taking the Airspun Loose Face Powder. This is just the white translucent powder. And I'm going to put that everywhere that I just put concealer. I'm just going to put it on the damp sponge and then dab it where I have concealer. While that sits on my face, I'm going to comb through my eyebrows with this um, e.l.f eyelash and brow wand. Next, I'm going to fill in my eyebrows with the Anastasia Dip Brow Pomade. I am in the shade Blonde and a Morphe M165 brush. Now I'm going to take this big old powder brush. I don't know what brand this is. Oh wait, it says Cala on the side. Um, I just got these at TJ Maxx and I am going to just dust all the powder off. I'm going to use the Too Faced Natural Matte Palette today. This is one of my all-time favorite palettes. It just has nine matte shades in it, and I absolutely love the shades in this palette. I wear a lot of, like, neutral colors, so this is a really good, like, everyday palette for me. So first, I'm going to be using this Morphe Jaclyn Hill JH30. It's just a big, fluffy blending brush, and I'm going to grab this shade right here. It is called Lace Teddy. And I'm just going to put that all over my lid. Next, I'm going to be using a Morphe Jaclyn Hill JH33 brush. And I'm going to be going into the shade Nudie. And I'm just going to put that all in my crease and blend it up. Now, I'm going to use this shade right here called Strapless. And I'm going to put that in my all over my crease again, just not blend up as far. Now I'm going to use a Morphe Jaclyn Hill JH40 brush. I'm going to go into the shade Chocolate Cookie down here. And I'm going to keep that on my outer corner. Now I'm going to be using a Morphe Jaclyn Hill JH41 brush. It's just a flat brush. And I'm going to go into the shade Heaven. It's just a white shade. And I'm going to put that on the inner half of my lid. I'm going to go back with the Morphe Jaclyn Hill JH33 and go back into Nudie and then I'm just going to kind of blend it all out. Now I'm going to use this Morphe Jaclyn Hill JH39. It's just a teeny tiny brush and we are going to go into the shade Strapless and we are going to put that under my waterline. Now I'm going to take the Morphe Jaclyn Hill JH42 and this highlighter out of the MAC Queen Supreme palette. I'm just going to use this highlighter right here and that is just going to go on my inner corners and up on my brow bone. Now I'm just going to do a thin line of eyeliner with the Maybelline Master Precise All Day Liquid Eyeliner in the shade Black. For lashes today, we are going to be using the Ari Shine Magnetic Lashes. You can find these on Amazon. These are my all-time favorite lashes. First, we are going to be applying the glue, and this is just like a magnetic eyeliner. So I'm basically going to reapply eyeliner 
but with this. So while we wait for that to dry, I'm just going to go in with the Too Faced Chocolate Soleil Bronzer. And then we are going to use a Farrah Contour 218M brush. I am just going to contour my cheeks, my forehead, and my nose. Now I'm going to be using a Morphe Jaclyn Hill JH06 brush and a MAC blush in the shade. The shade wore off the back of it, so I'm not sure what shade this is. It's just a natural pink blush, and I'm just going to put this on my cheeks and then a bop on my nose. If you can't tell, I don't like super pink blushes. I just like to keep it pretty neutral. For highlighter, I'm going to be using a Morphe Jaclyn Hill JH09 brush and the same highlighter that was in the MAC Queen Supreme palette. And I'm just going to do it on the tops of my cheekbones and the tip of my nose. Now I'm going to be setting my face with the Morphe Continuous Setting Mist. I'm going to put on a super light coat of mascara. This is just Mile High Club by Wander Beauty. Well, I'm going to pop on this bottom pair of eyelashes. I've actually never used these before or this particular pair in this kit. So I am very excited to see what these ones look like. So these are the lashes. I super love the way they look. I love these lashes. These again are the RA Shine Magnetic Lashes. You can get them on Amazon. The box I have is the pink and purple box. So the last thing we're gonna do is apply a red lip because this would not be a classic Christmas look without a classic red lip. I'm gonna be using the Fenty Beauty Matte Lipstick. This is in the shade Uncensored. This is my favorite red lipstick ever. I use this when I cheered. This was my game day lipstick. I love it so much. It's so nice. It doesn't smudge. It truly like lasts all day. You have to scrub it off, but it is such a beautiful shade of red as well. I really love it a lot. That is today's look. I hope you guys enjoyed my classic Christmas glam makeup look. If you did, be sure to give this video a thumbs up, drop a comment down below, and subscribe to my channel, and make sure that you hit the notification bell so that you won't miss an upload from me. Bye.